Hi everyone, this is Ami Diamond. How are you? Thanks for joining this uh, uh, podcast. Uh, I would like to introduce in this new episode a new feature that appeared in the stream web part in SharePoint. So what we will do is we will edit the page and we will click on a plus and let's add the stream web part. Once we add it, then automatically uh, we can choose uh, between theater and grid, uh, but we'll click on edit the web part and here we can uh, choose the source. So up until now, we could choose between videos on this site, we'll bring only videos on this site, we could choose a folder and a single video. Now we have the possibility to choose a playlist. A playlist is one of the templates of Microsoft List or SharePoint List. And let's see how we do it. So first of all, uh, if we choose something uh, video on this site, then it will present only the videos on this site. And we can choose between theater and grid. We can define uh, how many uh, videos will show up and how many rows and the way to sort it. So um, the folder way is you can choose a folder on a document library on this site or from other sites. So this is what you can see or even OneDrive. Now the playlist uh, is the new possibility. So you choose the source playlist and you can choose playlists that were created on this site. So here's one playlist I created which is called Playlist Army. And you can see here I have four video videos. I can switch between theater and grid. And um, I can choose uh, how many videos will appear and how many rows. If I choose the other playlist, you'll see it's totally different. And I chose here. Um, and when you hover, you can see the video. Now let's uh, demonstrate. For instance, I created a playlist on a different site. The site is called uh, Falcon uh, Project Falcon. You see there's four videos, but it's not on the same uh, site. So uh, if we go here, we will not see, you will see only those that were created on this site. Um, just for the experiment, let's create an, a new playlist to show you how we do it. So we'll click on new, click on list, and we will choose a list a playlist from here. We'll use the template and let's call it uh, demo three. Oops, demo three. And once we create the template, we could add some videos. So we can click on the add new item and we could uh, choose from uh, recent, from shared, from other sites or whatever we want. Currently, let's maybe take this one and take uh, this one and this one. So we added the three, we're happy, we can see them and we have the name uh, demo three. And edit the web part and uh, click the pencil and now we have the third playlist that we can uh, adjust. Now notice that the sort by now has um, uh, by playlist order, recent created, recent edit, and author. So let's uh, leave this as, as it is now. And let's publish. And let's see how it works. So I click here and we will see here actually that the video is playing. And uh, so in addition to only this, this site and uh, from the folder for a single video, we can use the playlist of the, of the Microsoft list. So this is a new feature. Uh, try it out when it gets to your tenant. And see you in the next episode. Goodbye. May I remind you, please uh, subscribe.
click the bell in order to get alerts and uh, support me. Goodbye.